Okay, so to open Microsoft Access, you're going to want to go to your start menu down here and you're going to want to type the word access. It's going to show up like this icon here. That's just one way to do it. Another way you could do it, I've actually put a shortcut on my taskbar and you could put a shortcut on your desktop as well. So all I have to do is go to my taskbar, which is this thing down here, and I just have to click on where I have the icon access. Now, when Microsoft Access opens up, this is what it will look like. It's, it looks very similar to Word, Excel, PowerPoint, because again, they're all Microsoft apps. I typically tend to go to blank database. Now, for this purpose, blank database is the best option. If you're someone working for a company that wants to create a specific kind of database, then you can look through the templates that they have. But for us here, it's going to be blank database. It's going to ask me where I want to save it and the name I want to save it as. What I'm going to do, I'm going to simply change this to, I think it was 2020 paper. You should obviously name it something more sensible. And the exam paper will tell you what you need to do. And I'm going to change the location from here to probably downloads is a good location. It's actually desktop. Let me change it to desktop. I'm going to click OK. And then I'm just going to simply click create. And now that's me creating my database here. Nothing else has been done at this point. So the next video, I'm going to show you guys how to then start adding information to your database or adding tables. So again, this is how you create your blank, your empty database.